Daz here from microandroid.com and I want to show you a really great game and it's called Pocket Soccer um, and it's basically the perfect mashup. It's between football, air hockey and Subutio I'd say. It sounds crazy right? But um, bear with me. It's a cool game and uh, I played this for ages earlier, you know, over an hour, which is unheard of for a, uh, a football game. Um, you've got a single player, two player trainer mode, all available on the same handset. This would be a great game for a tablet. But um, I'll show you trainer mode and you'll get the idea of uh, what it's all about. So you, here with the blue puck, we've got the two red pucks. Um, they're not going to move because we're in the trainer mode. The idea is, uh, like air hockey or like bowls or like Sabutia, um, we've got to try and score the goal, uh, put the football into the goal. So take the puck, and we've got a goal. And it's as easy as that. Sounds very easy, I know. If I change the training game, you'll see that it's slightly more difficult when there's movement involved. Oof. Not quite. Um, we'll just retry that one. So, we've still got movement. Damn. Anyway, training mode. Uh, there's, some, there's some training modes to show you. Penalties. Oof. Saved. The idea is that you've always got to try and score a goal past the opponent's puck, but let me just show you the actual game uh, itself. Single player, this is where it gets really fun. So, easy to start with, make life nice and easy for us. Uh, and we'll choose someone, let's choose Brazil as our opponent, and we'll choose uh, England as our player. And we got a game, so let's turn the media volume up so we can hear the crowds. So when we're lit up, we're allowed to move the uh, English pucks. That's only when it's our turn, and uh, when our previous yes, when our previous attempt is uh, slowed down. And so the idea is that now we're having to play very strategically. We, uh, it's like chess, like air hockey. I don't know. It's a goal against us. Um, no. Got to be trying to think all the time about defence as well. Oh no, he says. Now it's obviously a multi-touch game. Um, it's obviously it'd be absolutely impossible uh, with a resistor screen, but with this capacitive screen, it's absolutely fine. Um, oh, it's free. The uh, speed that you place onto your moving puck all comes into play. So if I fire up this one back there, you'll see. It's almost like a, a bowls effect with the, with the jacks. Oh. oh, it's um. You find that some goals are very simple, and some goals take a long time. And again, it's kind of frantic. I'm sure after a lot of practice, you'd be able to nail this. It's a great game. Download it, it's a lot harder than it looks, I can assure you. Um, it is the absolute essence of uh, sim simplicity in terms of its uh, graphics and its uh, gameplay. Um, but I think that's what all adds to it. Um, you can have hours of fun, and um, it's free, so there's, there's no reason not to go away and download this. I'll just show you two player just very quickly. So you've got an idea. Imagine that you've got someone on this end of the screen, you know, playing like, like me, and then, you know, your friend or your girlfriend or whatever on this side. You could be really. It's more difficult. I'll play it like this. I'll show you. So you can actually be trading blows within the actual game itself. Um, so imagine this on a, one of these new. 10 inch Android tablets, uh, I should get the idea, it'd be really good fun um, to play. Now there's obviously, especially in the single player, there's a easy, medium and a hard mode. If I just go back to uh, hard mode, to give you an idea of just how difficult this can be. Get ready. Straight away. It's, um, it's like these really fancy chess games that if you just leave it open for just one second, the computer would have uh, got you nailed. It always knows where to go. Obviously, it, hasn't, it isn't worried about fingers in the way of the screens. 
doesn't need to know about all that, so this is going to offer a lot of playability uh, day on day. It's going to take away a lot of boredom on trains. Um, it's great for football fans, great for air hockey fans, it's great for simple games fans alike. I um, hope you enjoyed the review. And uh, go and download this. It's called Pocket Soccer. It's free, so there's no excuses. It'd be great on a tablet, and it's even better on a, a mobile phone, so you can whip it out on the bus, train, or <laughs> whenever. Um, thanks. Uh, please subscribe, and please visit migrateandroid.com. See ya.